aren't you? No, Sheridan, don't open it. I can't let Alistair find me in here. Sheridan, what the hell's the matter with you? What are you doing? He's in here. <sighs> He's in here. I can feel it. Who's in there? What are you talking about? Luis. I can feel his presence. I, I, I can... I can feel him in here. Oh, don't be ridiculous. Luis Lopez Fitzgerald is not allowed anywhere near Crane Industries. And he's certainly not in a closet in my private office. The security guards would have thrown him out long before he ever got this far. It's so strange. I've just sworn that he was here. He just felt so near to me. <laughs> You're hallucinating, dear. Oh, come on. Let's get out of here. Just take it easy, Sheridan. You'll be fine. I am fine, Father. I, I just have this overwhelming feeling that Luis was nearby. Well, as I said, that's impossible. Now, I, I, I think the best thing is for you to go home and get some rest. No, 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 wait. I, I came here to talk to you about something. What is it? I spend too much time thinking about the baby I lost. I really need something to do. Would you please give me a job? A job? It wouldn't have to be anything important, just something to keep me busy. <laughs> well, all right. I, I, I can only think of one thing you're suited for. Uh, I'll, I'll give you a shot at working in our charity organization. You can help with the fundraising. Oh, that would be great. <gasps> Thank you, Father. Thank you so much. I, I promise you won't regret it. Uh, well, <laughs> we'll see about that. <laughs> now, I, I really must get back to work, and you need to get home to your husband. I will. I will. Thank you. Thank you again so much. Louise? That's right. Maybe I am imagining things today.